Hey everyone, I'm going to be doing a Christmas haul. I decided to do one um, just for fun. So everything that I show um, is not going to be in any kind of order or anything like that. Um, I got my dog a new sweater. Say hi, Bobby. Say hi. Um, she was really spoiled this year. She got... Um, two sweaters, new um, dishes, a new water bowl, a new food dish. She got a scarf and a placemat for her dishes and I don't even remember what all we got her. Start with um, Christmas stuff that I got. And I'm just gonna like grab what's in front of me. And I got this blanket. It's pink with cupcakes all over it. It's really soft and warm. My mom got this for me. I picked it out, um, but she bought it for me. I got this adorable owl tea set. It looks like this. And this part, um, his head is the little teapot. And then the bottom part is the mug. And then it came with a matching little um, canister and then the uh, tea bags just slide out of here. I thought this was so cute and this set was $10 at Big Lots and I also picked that out. My mom and dad for like my big present that they got me, um, I got an iPod Nano. I've never had one before and so I decided that I wanted to try one out because I, I, I never, I've never owned any Apple product. I just I don't know. I, I know a lot of people are obsessed with everything Apple, but to me it's just like whatever, you know. But I got one of the Nanos, which looks like this. It's just pink. It's really small and cute. I haven't really played with it yet. I'm still um, in the midst of downloading music and everything for it. So I thought it would be nice to have when I'm out like riding my bike and stuff. My mom also got me this um, little heart. Um, I guess you could use this as a key ring, but I think its purpose is to hang like on a purse just for like a little decoration, kind of. So my parents got me that. And my parents got me this set of Archer Farms. This is from Target. Um, coffee, little coffee sets. And I have tried the pumpkin pie spice before, but I wanted to try out the other kinds. I picked this out too. I mean, like, we would go shopping and I just, like, pick things out. Like, buy this for me for Christmas, so. That way I know that, like, I'm getting things that I want instead of, like, my parents just kind of, like, um, picking things out themselves. I mean, sometimes they're good with it, but other times it's like, you know, what am I supposed to do with that? So this has um, pumpkin pie spice, Christmas blend, white chocolate cranberry eggnog, and breakfast blend. And I like this brand of coffee. Like I said, I've tried the pumpkin pie spice before, and I've also tried um, some sort of like vanilla cinnamon nut or something like that. And they're good. And you can use these in, I have a Keurig I got last year for Christmas, and if you have... Um, a filter for it that you can use um, any ground coffees. I mean this top which I also picked out it's kind of um, got that um, layered look to it like it's a top over top of another top but I thought that was really cute um, that was from Kohl's. I got me uh, this sweater that I have on actually from Victoria's Secret. We got it off of their website. My boyfriend also got me this sweater as well. And this one is brown. It's kind of like the same deal as far as um, it's got like the little flyaway, I guess you'd say, um, opening. Because it doesn't close, it just, you know, is open. He has pretty good taste when it comes to clothes, so. And um, this sweater, actually, you get a free scarf if you ordered a sweater from Victoria's Secret. And this was the free scarf, which it's a really nice scarf. It's um, just ivory color and really soft and pretty. He also got me, like, 
lingerie and bras and panties and stuff, but I'm not going to show that. Um, but I will show this. This is a uh, pajama set that he got me. Obviously, these came with pants, but I don't have it buttoned up because I wore these last night to bed. But they're just a um, pink stripe. So they were comfortable. But my parents got me this top, which was from Kohl's, but I picked it out. And it's just purple. Um, my aunt and uncle got me a Bath and Body Works Peach Bellini hand soap. This smells really good. And my boyfriend knew that I liked the Archer Farms coffees. So he ended up getting me two for my um, stocking. And the one is breakfast blend and the other is hazelnut. The breakfast blend did come with the pack that I got from my parents, but the hazelnut did not. So that's not so bad. And I want to try them out, so I don't care that I got two. And plus, they're, on, they're such a size that they're great to try out. Uh, before buying a full size bag of them in case you don't like it and you get um, a good amount of uses out of just one small bag. My parents got me a soft soap strawberry smoother body butter wash and this is in strawberry and it smells so good. I actually picked this out too. Oh my god it smells really amazing. So they got that. I will show the lingerie piece that my boyfriend got me because it's really pretty. Looks like this. This is one of the bras. I'm wearing the other one. This one's pink with um, pretty rhinestones and stuff on the sides and then it's also got rhinestones on the uh, strap so pretty the one i'm wearing is probably like peeking out of my top these bras oh my god you guys this is obscene and i probably shouldn't even be like mentioning my boobs or anything but i have a pretty small chest i'm only a b cup um but these bras they do wonders for your boobs if you got small boobs because like I look like a C right now or, or some something like that and I am not a C. These bras are like, there's so much padding in them, it's insane. Like, they even have a padding on the side here so it kind of like squeezes your tits together. So, I mean it like, you know, lifts them up so you got mad cleavage. You know, it's amazing how well women can fake everything about themselves that I kind of feel bad for men because they don't really know what they're getting when they're with a woman you know we can fake our boob size we can fake our butts I mean they came out with those um, underwear that have like lips and stuff in them you know it's like you can fake your fingernails you can fake your eyelashes it's like you can even fake your eyebrows. I mean, if you get like your eyebrows tattooed on or some shit, it's like it's crazy. It's really crazy. My parents got me again. I picked it out a new tumbler. Uh, this one's just pink. I like putting my iced coffees in these um, in the summertime, so I picked out this one. The one that I have is brown, which I mean I like it and everything. But when I bought that, there really wasn't a whole lot of options as far as other colors go when I bought that one. And now there's like every color imaginable. I got lots of socks. I got these socks. These are new highs. It came with this leopard pair and then a solid pair. My boyfriend got me those. Um, panties from Victoria's Secret. Um, my boyfriend got me these packs of socks. I actually picked out these socks from the Dollar Tree. Um, my parents got them for me. They got little gingerbread on gingerbread men on them, and they say, "Oh snap!" I thought they were so cute, so I picked that out. Um, oh, and I picked out these socks um, that my parents got me. These are just 
hot neon socks. I'm actually wearing a pair right now. My boyfriend got me this sweater. This is one of those um, cow neck sweaters. Like it, you can wear it off the shoulder or um, down. It's gray and I gotta wear like a cami underneath because it's kind of see-through. But you can like wear it off your shoulders or you can like just bunch it down real well like that. So that's cute. Okay. One of my favorite games, um, like video games, was Bioshock. I don't know if any of you guys are familiar with that or not. But I had to have this. Like, way before Christmas. Way, way, way before. Um, my boyfriend and I were at Toys R Us. And I saw this there. And I just had to have it. This is a, um, a splicer mask. And it's a bunny mask. And it's awesome. This is like a really nicely made mask. This isn't like a cheapy plastic. It's kind of like a resiny material. Um, it's kind of heavy. Um, the only downfall with this is that it, since it's heavy, it doesn't want to stay on my head right, which is a little upsetting. But oh my gosh, it's awesome, and I just I had to have it. This is what it would look like on. Well, see, it actually stays on rather well, um, this way. I just don't have, like, a real big head, so it, this probably wasn't really made to wear or anything like that, more for, like, decorative purposes, but I had to have it. Oh my god, I love it! Okay. I don't want to do my whole video with that anyway. The mask actually came with, uh, a Bioshock figures. Which, I'm not really into collecting figures, um, like that, but, you know, I don't mind. It was one of my favorite video games, so, um, this is what is called a Big Daddy. He's pretty detailed, and, like, you know, everything on him, like, well, not everything on him, but he can, like, move and everything like that. Like, posable move, so. He's pretty cool. But, um, my favorite other than the mask that came with that, Little Sister, and this is what she looks like. She's really creepy. And it's so awesome, like, how well she moves, too, like, how you can bend her and pose her. And then she came with her little... Oh, I love them. Okay. I picked out these socks that my parents got me. These are just like long socks from Kohl's. I actually wore them today. Alright, please don't judge me for this next one because I know I am an adult and I really shouldn't have dolls but the monster high dolls ever since they came out i just had to have one because they're so creepy and cute and i'm just totally in love with that kind of stuff and so upset that they didn't have something like that when i was younger and this one was my absolute favorite the frankie frankie stein i think her name is i don't even remember anymore but i i just had to have her and now i want more of them So I got her, and she came with um, her little dog thing, pet. But speaking of figurines, um, I had found this, um, these things called furry bones, and I am like really into like creepy things, like cute creepy things, and these are just so right up my alley that I had to have them. So my boyfriend got me three of them for Christmas. Um, this one's a little bunny rabbit. And these are made of like a hard resin, I guess you'd say, material. So he got me that one. He got me the kitty cat. And then my absolute favorite one is a little owl with a little lollipop. I love these so much. I have to have more of them now. 
I got like, oh my gosh, so much candy and junk food and cookies that I am going to gain so much weight before um, Christmas is over. Or not Christmas is over, because Christmas is over, but before winter is over. Um, so I'm not going to show all of that kind of stuff, just like the more interesting things. Um, my boyfriend got me freeze-dried astronaut ice cream which is so awesome. I used to get this stuff like when I was younger and we'd go to like science museums. So, and, and it was good, I liked it. So we'll see, you know, years later if I was just out of my mind because I thought it was cool and that's why I thought it tasted good. All right, I'm gonna get into some of the beauty related stuff. So um, I might edit that so the beauty stuff's first just in case no one else cares about anything else. Um, every year I get a lash stash from Sephora and I can't say enough good things about these. Um, I wear mascara every single day. Like, every day. If I don't, it doesn't look like I have eyelashes. Because my eyelashes are very blonde. So, I need mascara to survive. And a lash sash box will last me all year. I mean, it, it all year. So, I don't have to buy a mascara. Um... And it's great because I can test out different ones and there's never one that like I absolutely hate and despise enough that it's not like worth it in the end. And I will say their boxes this year are really pretty. This is um, pink and glittery and awesome. And inside there are, this year it comes with two full size mascaras. And then one, two, three, four, eight smaller mascaras. And then it also comes with a, um, um, a mascara eye makeup remover. So I'm not going to go into like full detail of these. Um, if you want me to, I can make a separate video. I just don't want to go um, crazy with the length of this video. But um, I definitely recommend the lash stashes um, as a holiday gift. For yourself if you are you know big into mascaras and like trying different ones so he also got me the glitz and glam set and this one is in a really pretty gold box it's like this and then this one has all sorts of stuff in it too which again i'm not going to go into full detail but these are all like Stuff with like shimmer in it and stuff like that, um, hence the name Glip and Glam. So I got that one. Uh, he got me the Too Faced In Your Dreams palette and this is so pretty. This is gorgeous. I, I love Too Faced products not just their products their packaging everything about it and I mean, you can't tell me that this is not the most gorgeous packaging ever so when you open it up it has nine eyeshadows three blushes and three lip glosses that's what that looks like oh I totally forgot some of the um, little candies I got. I got a thing of Hello Panda cookies. I got like strawberry cream in them. And chocolate mushrooms. And you can find these at Giant. You don't have to go to like a specialty kind of store to find um, these Asian candies. I got these Vera Simply Vera slippers. My parents got these for me. These are so cute and they're really comfortable too. I wanted to try one of these hard candy uh, fox in a box blushes. So my boyfriend got me this one in spicy and sweet. I haven't tried it yet. Um, the only thing that I don't really care for is the fact that the lid doesn't close on them. That's like really piss poor packaging right there. I got a shark. I haven't really tried this too much. I mean, we tested it out 
um, the other day and it seems to work well but if you're used to a Swiffer this is not like a Swiffer at all a Swiffer you don't really have to apply much effort to push it around this you really gotta use your arms to push it so it's gonna take a little while to get used to because I'm not used to applying that much effort into my cleaning but um, you know I'll just have to get some muscles in my arms now to what everyone is waiting for the beauty related stuff I ended up getting two of the Benefit blushes and Ulta was doing this great sale where they had these this duo pack of them for I think it was $16 don't quote me on that but I think it was $16 and that was a really good deal so um, the pack came with Georgia and Throb so they look like that and I've never had one of these before so I was really happy because I want to try them out and the one reason that I wanted the hard candy fox in a box was because it was so similar to these um, like packaging wise like I figured they'd be similar but um, you know that hard candy one can kiss my ass with its packaging because no I got benefit ones I will still use that one, but that packaging really pisses me off. You can tell, like, Hard Candy used to be a more high-end brand. Like, it was sold at Sephora, like, a long time ago. Well, it might not even been that long ago. But then they, I guess, dumbed themselves down so they could be sold at Walmart and be a little more affordable. But I think they, like... I mean, the quality of their stuff seems to be alright still. But the packaging is, I don't know, Walmart quality, definitely. Okay, um, I got this bracelet, which I absolutely love. This is by the Lauren Conrad Collection, which is my favorite from Kohl's. And this one's just like a pearl bracelet with little silver leaves dangling off of it. And then my mom always buys me a piece of jewelry. Uh, for Christmas this year she got me um, just this one it's just a simple three row um, necklace she usually gets me these at like the Bon Ton or like some department store like that uh, my parents got me two Revlon lipsticks. I've been wanting to try these. I haven't ever had one yet. And these are the Revlon Color Burst lipsticks. So I got one in Petal and one in Pink Sugar. And these are the colors. And my parents got me uh, two perfume sets. I got a Juicy Couture one um the viva la juicy and this one came with uh this bottle a size bottle a lotion and then a mini size bottle and then they also got me a michael kors berry hollywood one which comes with this size bottle and then a shower gel and um lotion My boyfriend got me two NYX um, loose shadows. One is in pearl and the other one's in mink pearl. Um, my boyfriend also got me two OPI um, shadow nail polishes. One is silver and the other one is white. My aunt got me an Orly nail polish set. It came with three nail polishes. And it also came with a pair of um, these fingerless gloves. And the gloves are actually really cute, except uh, they have like some sort of black um, flower thing on the tops, which just looks like a blob to me. I don't know. I wish that I could take that off because I think it's rather ugly 
But I don't think I can take it off, so it saddens me. But they came with the nail polishes. And the nail polishes, this one is Star Spangled, which is a red glitter. This one is Shimmering Mauve. And then this one is Naughty. My boyfriend got me a Tarte set. Oh, what I wish I would have saved the box so I could have showed you guys. Um, okay, it came with a Tarte Lip Surgeon Lip Luster. Uh, la, 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 la. I'm not sure what shade this is or if it has a shade name. But it's a um, just like a pink color. It came with a... Perfect pink Amazonian white clay infused cheek stain, which smells really good. And then it came with a light camera lashes mascara. And what was weird about this is that the mascara that was on the package was in like a purple tube that looked like it was like wrapped in like some sort of like faux snakeskin wrap or something and that is not the mascara that was in it i think it's the same mascara essentially like the lights camera lashes mascara but it just was not the same mascara which i think is really weird it's purple but it's not the same packaging i don't know i just i thought it was weird but i'm not complaining i just thought it was weird i uh, he got me this perfume bottle for my vanity and this is really pretty you can get these at Hobby Lobby and I never had anything like this before you can put the perfume down in this little well and then you uh, dab it on with this stick thing Um, what's that, the, what was the philosophy set called? Do you remember? Mary, Mary, I don't know. Anyway, you got me this philosophy uh, set. It came with four uh, three-in-ones and four matching lip glosses. So it came with pomegranate, pomegranate bubbly. And then it came with a pomegranate bubbly lip gloss. An eggnog three in one. Which came with an eggnog lip gloss. A peppermint bark three in one. With a peppermint bark lip gloss. A sugar sprinkles funnel cake. Which came with a sugar sprinkles funnel cake lip gloss. And this one is by far my favorite scent out of all of them. Then it would be the eggnog, peppermint bark, and then the pomegranate. And then, when he ordered from Sephora, um, it came with like a little sample bag full of samples. And that's what this stuff is. I'm not really going to go through all of it. Because I want to get through everything else. So I had gotten a $25 gift card to Kohl's from my aunt and uncle. So I went today to use that and I got this top. This was by the Jennifer Lopez line. And I tried this on uh, one of the last times I was at Kohl's, but it, it was on the clearance rack, but it was still like $19. And I could only buy one top, so I put this one back. But they still had it when I went in. And the, the, there's these pretty beaded... What? No, they're not birds. I, I, I don't really know what they are, but <laughs> it's pretty. So I got that. And I was on clearance for $19. And then I got this, which I also had tried on the one day, but I don't recall it being 4 bucks, And it was only 4 bucks today. And this is by the Lauren Conroy collection, which is my absolute favorite collection at Kohl's. And this is just one of those, like, layering pieces. And it was only $4, so it's awesome. So I still had some money left over on my card. 
And then I went to Forever 21 today because my parents gave me $50 to go shopping. And I got some things there. I got some solid, just basic tops. I got a, a maroon one. That one was short sleeved. I got a blue one and this one is short sleeved. I got a brown one. This one's long sleeved. I got this one, which has like a crochet uh, neck. It's really cute. I got this peachy pink one. This one's sheer, so I have to wear a cami underneath. But it's got like a flower design on it. And then I got a buttload of um, just plain solid camis. I got a... Uh, I got a tan one. A white one. A gray one. And a black one. And these are really nice for just like layering and stuff. They're only $2.80. It's very, very cheap and affordable. And that is my Christmas haul. And I hope you guys like the video.